<laughs> I don't know what I was going to say, but it's a little bit longer between, you know, I don't know why I didn't pick up the camera any sooner than like the last clip. I literally had to look back at the last clip because I couldn't remember the last thing that I filmed. Um, but I was like getting ready for a doctor's appointment when I was 18 weeks. I am 19 weeks now. I'm almost 20 weeks. In two days, I'm going to be 20 weeks. So, <clears throat> I don't know why I didn't pick up the camera sooner. I got my hair done. Um, we did like a melting and like brought my roots down a little bit longer because <clears throat> it's just so hard. Like, it's the maintenance. But then again, like, I'm going to have to get my hair done more because my grades are really, really bad. But this way with the melting because it's just like my roots it's just going to be like a root touch up the times that I go because I was telling my um hairstylist I was like I can't be like once the baby comes like I can't I can't stay at an appointment for five hours for you putting in like a balayage like I just can't do that um but I can do like two hours and I think that would be like max <clears throat> and she's like 40 minutes away from me now Ugh, but anyways, yeah, so I got my hair done, went to the doctors, um, was telling her, so I asked her about, like, all my questions, um, I asked her, like, what kind of placenta that I had, <clears throat> but, so here's the thing, like, I don't understand how some people, like, know what kind of placenta that they have until their, um, until their anatomy scan, because, like, I feel like some people are like, oh, I'm 17 weeks and I have an anterior placenta. And I'm like, how the hell do you know that? Because <clears throat> when I asked my doctor, she's like, oh, we'll be figuring that out when we go to, um, when you go to the anatomy scan. But I did feel him for the first time on Saturday. So that was really exciting. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I'm 19 weeks now. My my head's going everywhere. But yeah, I'm 19 weeks. Yeah, I think I did say that. <laughs> Almost 20 weeks. Um, but I did feel him. We got a Doppler. So we've been able to hear him. I'll insert a clip of his heartbeat right here at home. Okay. Going down low, right? Yeah. Tell me when I put, if I put too much pressure. That's a good one. I'm losing it. Yeah, he's moving. Yeah, that's him. Yep. That's him. He's in there. And then we sent that to um, family so they could hear it. Um, and it's just really exciting. Um, it was more just like, kind of not reassurance. Like, yeah, I guess prenatal anxiety, but it's just like, now that I could feel him sometimes, it's like kind of helpful, but I'm like wearing a Christmas sweater. <laughs> um, but it's just nice, like, <clears throat> we don't do it every day. We do it like every other, maybe three times, every three days. But it's just like, do I listen to him for a little bit? Like, and we don't sit there and like listen to him for like 10 minutes. We listen to him for like two. <laughs> That's about it. Um, but yeah, so I was asking questions about my headaches. And stuff like that. And um, she didn't give me a prescription, which is okay. Um, we settled on me going to the chiropractor because it's tension headaches. Like, I'm very tense around, like, the back of my neck and my shoulders. And that's basically causing these headaches. Um, so, we'll see. I was really trying to hold off and I said that. I was really trying to hold off. Um, I still haven't made any 
because I've made adjustments to my sleeping, so maybe that's what did it. I don't know. Um, and then she also said, like, prenatal um, massages are a really good start, too. Um, and it basically just, like, relaxes your body. And you know what? I don't really mind them. They're just expensive. I mean, they're not that expensive. But I'm thinking about getting, like, a membership to... I think it's Elements Massage here in Vegas. Like, that's where I've gotten, like, Connor's gotten me massages in the past. And I know they have, like, a month-to-month, -month, like, subscription. So, I'm thinking about doing that. I just haven't, I think I have to go in to do the subscription. Like, I can't do it online. But, yeah. So, we decided on doing that instead. And then I know that I have, like, I know the joint does, um, what, I think it's web, like, you have to be Webster certified for, prenatal um chiropractic chiro chiropractic i don't chiropractic i don't know i don't know the right word of chiropractor for that <laughs> um but i know the joint um has um chiropractors that are webster certified that's the best way i could put it um and there's not there's one right next to a target which can get me in trouble but um i still need to do that and chiropractors aren't that much but chiropractors creep me out like what was it like a year ago I pulled my back out plugging in my laptop in the wall and I pulled my back out and it was awful for like two months and I've never been to a chiropractor before I've watched an ex-boyfriend at the chiropractor before and it literally just creeps me out like like what if they just twist your neck wrong and they just and you just die <laughs> it just scares me but yeah so I don't know I had to go, more or less stories, I had to go, like, last year to, like, help my back, and it wasn't so bad, but it still, like, creeps me out a little bit, but, um, yeah, that's what we decided to do, but, so I started changing the way I sleep, so I noticed that, like, when I sit upright, and I, and, like, my neck is not, like, bent or anything like that, or... I don't know what I'm trying to say, but basically, like, I sleep with two pillows, and I basically, like, sl sl sleep upright <laughs> at this point, and, um, three out of the four days that I've woke, like, the past four days that I've woken up, I haven't had a headache, so maybe that's it, maybe it's not, I don't know, but it's helped, so we'll see, um, but yeah, uh, 20 weeks on Wednesday, which is going to be in two days, um, I started getting acid reflux, which is fun. Honestly, I'd rather have acid reflux than the tension headache, so I'll, I'll say that. Um, but other than that, I'm good. Um, I've noticed, too, when I eat and drink carbonated drinks like soda, um, I feel expanded, and I just feel like so bloated and, and stuff that I just, I don't feel good. <clears throat> so, I don't know. Sometimes I feel like I need soda. Um, because I'm like, maybe, maybe just like a can of soda will help with like caffeine and like relieve headaches. So, I think that's why I, I do that. I don't drink soda that often, but like last night we had pizza and I had a Pepsi with it. And I was just like, oh my god, I feel like shit. <laughs> I feel awful. Like, because I was just so full. And I think it's just like the carbon just like expanding. Um, but yeah. Um, we don't have our anatomy scan until the 18th, which is in two weeks now. So I'll be like 21. Like the center that does it for my doctor, they said that they don't do it until 20 weeks. But I'll be like 20, 20 weeks and five days, <clears throat> which is a little bit later than I wanted to because I would like to just spend an hour looking at my child because I haven't seen him in a while. But, yeah, that's about it. Got nothing else in the world going on. We went to Dietz for the first time yesterday, and we just picked up a bunch of snacks. <laughs> and I got a fitness ball because I was like, oh, I'm going to need it for, like, that in my pregnancy so I can bounce on it. But um, here's what we got if you wanted to see. But we got some, like, sweet corn pretzels. I think I'm pretty sure I've gotten these before, like, in a snack crate box. Um, I don't know. These, they looked good. Um, some watermelon gummy candy. We got a lot of gummies. Milky creamy strawberry. I thought this was going to be like the the Lifesavers one, so that's why I got it. But they're really not, but they're still good. Um, we got high chews. Berry mix, because we love high chews. These things are my favorite. So these are like a caramel uh, cream frappe candy. 
These are so freaking good. Like, so freaking good. Um, we got sweet and sour high chews. I really like the lemon one. There's lemon, grapefruit, and watermelon. I'm not trying the grapefruit because I hate grapefruit. And then we got these. And then we also got some other things. I also got more gummies too, but of course Connor ate them in a matter of like mm, 10 minutes. And there was like four different um, flavors. There was like peach, uh, pear, grape, and apple. And I only got to try peach and grape. <laughs> That's fine. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Nothing much going on. Um, I got some. I mean, I'll just show you. So, I'll bring these up. So, I got. I ordered. Well, I downloaded a digital print from Etsy for <clears throat> like the nursery pictures that I wanted to go with like our theme. And then I ordered some frames from Amazon. And I swear to God, I put in like hanging frames from Amazon. But they don't have the ability to be hung. <sighs> I'm out of breath now. Um, so we had to go get these sawtooth hangers to put on the back of them. But I will show you them. <sighs> I've been sitting in here. So I bought one of these little neck massagers. So I've been sitting in here massaging my neck. Because I thought that, that was going to help with my like tension headaches. Which it has helped. But um, yeah. So I got green frames for the um these guys here i just sat down but that's not gonna work so these are the prints i got a giraffe and i got the green frames um like a baby uh i think it's a lion i don't know and then a baby elephant i think they're so cute and they have like the eucalyptus to go along with it but i'm so sorry guys i'm out of breath <laughs> um but yeah, so I put in like hanging frame, but they're not hanging. Like there's nowhere to hang it. So I got those little, um, like these little sawtooth hangers to just put in the back of the frame so we can hang them. So we'll be doing that. And it's like a different green. Cause like everything else in here is like white and gray. So, and there's like different shades of green in the, um, bedding so I, it it works like I think it looks good and then we have like a white dresser that's not going there but still gray I wanted some white color or some color against the white um, walls because everything's white in here <laughs> which is my fault but I, we're so lazy we're not gonna paint we're not gonna paint so yeah that's it no other updates in the nursery, just got those, so I'm pretty slow at work. Um, because so I'm like in the servicing transfer department now. Come on up. And we just had our servicing transfer on Friday, so like it's a whole new month, so it's kind of chill. <clears throat> so I have a couple of things to do, but nothing like urgent or dire. Nothing that is gonna take me more than an hour to get done today, so I don't know. I don't know what I I'm gonna do. Connor's clean laundry, and now we got the Mr. Bear. He just got a haircut yesterday. Say hi, Mr. Bear. He hates when I'm interrupting his morning sleep. So, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you later this week because I'll probably update everybody. He's just staring at me. He's like, Can you get out of my room, please? Um, I will update you all about my my 20 weeks i'll probably post a picture too online of my belly okay Bye. what's up <laughs> i look so weird okay so i self-tanned i don't know if you could really tell i self-tanned like okay so <laughs> I obviously can't tan and I know it's bad but like before I went to Maui um, I went to the tanning bed but then I found out I was pregnant can't go no more that's fine because <sighs> it's like better for my skin but like I am so freaking pale that um, I need to do something so I got some self tan and I don't really you can tell right, right now like on my face um, because I'm sitting in front of a light, but 
Um, I am bronze. Like, it's weird. And Connor was just like, oh my god, like, you applied too much. So, last week, I barely applied, like, any. So, like, yesterday, I put some on, and I was like, okay, I'm, like, gonna put more on. And, like, I put a lot more on. Um, so, yeah, like, my hands, I don't know if you can really tell. You can kind of tell. I don't know. It is what it is. It is what it is. So, um, I'm trying to pick up the camera more. I am not bored because I don't really mind. I'd rather get paid to just sit and edit videos, but like, um, I don't really have much to do for work. Um, so yeah, not much going on. Um, I feel like I have something to say. I guess it was more just like addressing my fake tan. I don't know. I took a shower this morning and usually I don't shower until like night, but I kind of wanted to wash off the scent of it. Like it's not a bad scent, but it's just like, okay, I'd rather. And I wanted to see if like it would lighten a little bit. <laughs> I should fucking get some, I don't know, exfoliant to try and clear my hands. I'm getting my nails done today and I'm so excited because... I'm kind of like over my nails, um, so I think I'm like I think I'm gonna get these. They honestly remind me of like those um those dots, like the candy dots. And I was just like, oh, that's cute. I kind of want something like bright and summery, even though it's not summer yet. But it's warm in Vegas. But I guess Connor said it was supposed to like get down to the 60s next week, so I don't know. Um, I just listened to, um, one of my old, like, she's a friend from YouTube, Mandy, her and another YouTuber, Rosa, they started a crime podcast, um, so I was listening to that, and it sounds like a good time, like, they're, like, having a really fun time on there, um, me and my friend Megan, we did have a podcast. We've kind of fallen off a little bit. Um, it was... I don't know. It's, the thing is, like, sometimes, like, podcasting, it can take so much time. Like, for Megan and me, we would spend, like, three, four hours, like, podcasting on Sundays. And, like, that's kind of a long time. Um, like, I think in theory it sounds fun. And it is, but, like, it's the commitment. <laughs> it is really the commitment. So, ooh, I don't know. Um, my headaches haven't been too bad. I do have a slight headache today. Um, I, mean, I wonder if it's from my breakfast. I have Pop-Tarts instead of, like, something decent for me. <laughs> um, but, yeah. I'm just editing the video. I'm gonna upload it today and I'm probably just gonna make it live today. Usually I meant to excuse me, I meant to do it yesterday, but um I just kind of uh didn't do anything yesterday. Like I wasn't really busy at work e either and I pretty much just sat and like played Candy Crush. Uh, yeah, I'm back on that for some stupid reason. I think just to, like, waste my time. <laughs> and, um, yeah. So I'm going to make a thumbnail right now. Um, nothing really going on. Um, tomorrow I'm going to be 20 weeks. Um, Connor and I started talking about, um, the house again. Because we really want this KB house um, that we saw. We want to move to a newer area. It's called Ensperada. I don't know if I mentioned this. Um, uh, it's a really, really nice part of town. It's just really far away. Um, it's like, if you're familiar with Vegas, it's super, super south. It's like on the outskirts of Anthem. But it's like a new area that's like up and coming so it looks really freaking nice um and it's just really like um family oriented so like that's why we want to move there and we'd rather move there 
um, sooner rather than later because of the baby. But yeah, um, really don't have anything going on. I'm. I don't. I feel like there's nothing. Nothing to really fill you guys in on. So I apologize. My life is boring, and I think this is part of the reason why I stopped. Um. Um. Like filming. Um, because there's just like nothing to, <laughs> there's nothing to do, there's nothing to even talk about. Like my life is so boring. Hopefully it gets a little bit more exciting when the baby comes, but yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go and make a thumbnail and I will check in with you later. Okay, maybe you can kind of see like how bronze I am now. Yes, you can tell now. It's crazy, isn't it? Does it look orange? I feel like I feel like it kind of looks orange, but like also it doesn't at the same time. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. Um, so um, I'm gonna try and put these like sawtooth things in. I have an extra um, frame, so I'm gonna like try it once or try it with. Oh, it has a ruler on the end. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try this on like the extra frame that we have so I don't mess up the ones that I have the pictures in. So we'll see. Let's try it out. I don't know how well this is going to work. But... Oh, shit. Okay. It's got like little studs. So I don't know if I like need a uh, a hammer or not. Okay, if I want to put it on a nail, it has to be face down. Oh, 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 that's scurry. My God, my hands are so bad. Okay, I do think. I will need to hammer in them. Oh wait, no, I can push them in. Okay. Ah, shit, I just bent it. <laughs> Alright. Well, it's a good thing I, I can probably bend it back, but honestly, I just need the nails. Oh boy. The struggle. I should just make Connor do this. Because otherwise I'm just going to mess them all up. Well that was eventful, wasn't it? <laughs> um, I didn't think they were going to bend. I don't know how I'd be able to put them in. Because if that's the case, hammering them would cause that to... Um, Ben too. Huh. Well, shit. It's so frustrating because when I searched up on Amazon, I I searched hanging wall frames, and these came up. And you know what? I just didn't even bother to check, which is in total Amanda fashion. It really is, but whatever. I guess I'll survive. I guess I'll just, I don't, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Oh, it's getting hard to like get up and down because like he's sitting so low that like hurts my pelvis. That's so fun. Okay, well, back to being bored. That literally took like three minutes out of my life. And I got nothing else going on. Oh! I'll start my phone. But I did get a maternity, like a a birthing gown. You can't really tell. I don't really have her anywhere, so put ya. Let's see if I can turn the light on if it'll help. Because we got the lights installed. But I got my own because I'm obviously gonna try and breastfeed. And the hospital gowns aren't really, like, they don't 
basically allow you to breastfeed unless you want to pull your whole dress up or your whole gown up. So I got this one and it snaps in the front so you can breastfeed and actually still be clothed at the same time. And then um, it has the snaps in the back for if you want to get an epidural, um, which honestly I'm probably going to. I probably will. Let's be let's be real here. I'd love to go natural, but my I think my biggest fear with giving birth is um tearing. Like honestly, I'm like the most scared about that. Sorry. I'm a mess right now. Um yeah, that's the one thing. This is awful. This is the one thing I'm like the most scared about. Um, and I don't want to feel it. Which I know like with the adrenaline and everything. Like I probably won't. But like, I don't know. Hypothetically, I want to try and give birth naturally. Um, but then again, like there, there is no freaking award for giving birth without an epidural or with an epidural. Your reward is your child at the end of the day, regardless. So, I don't know. I don't know. It all depends on how bad the contractions are. I don't know. Because I want to say that I have a pretty high pain tolerance, but... I think this is going to be a completely different pain. <laughs> I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. So... Okay, I just want to show you that. That's what I got yesterday in the mail.